Hey everybody, 650 Ebs right here, and today we have a special treat to Kawasaki Ninja H2s in one setting for your viewing pleasure. Both of these motorcycles are similarly equipped, uh, but today we're going to talk about the zero gravity windscreens that are on these motorcycles. This one features the zero gravity Corsa uh, light smoke tinted screen and it is a very nice fit on the motorcycle. You can see that it has very clean lines. Uh, you don't see any kink in the windscreen from where it raises up. Very smooth. Um, this windscreen provides a tremendous amount of wind protection for the rider when he's on the motorcycle. Not only does it do that, but it also adds um, a better appearance to the motorcycle because it's tinted. And to me, that just looks outstanding. Um, it was very easy to install the windscreen onto the motorcycle. All it requires is a three millimeter um, Allen wrench. And there are a few bolts here that you take off. Roughly about six bolts. And uh, installation takes less than 10 minutes. If you do it once or twice, you could probably do it in about five minutes but this windscreen is very nice. This of course is Mustang Dames Kawasaki Ninja H2 and next to it we have my Ninja H2 650 Ebs and this one has the zero gravity double bubble windscreen and as you can see this one has lines um, indicating where it rises up and where it provides that extra level of protection from the wind and I like that because uh, the motorcycle has fi has fine lines in it. If you can see here on the front fairing, the lines of the fairing almost follow the lines of the double bubble windscreen. And to me that looks pretty nice. But you can't go wrong with either of these windscreens. They both provide superior wind protection. They both add um, a better appearance to the motorcycle because they're tinted and they turn an already remarkable looking motorcycle into an outstanding machine. You can see here the rider can tuck nice and underneath this windscreen. Get some protection from the wind at 65 miles an hour, which is probably the fastest most, most uh, H2 owners will take their motorcycles. And you can see it's very similar for this one too. Side by side. They pretty much both have the same amount of wind protection. I don't think there is an advantage as far as wind protection for either of the screens. I think that what it boils down to is your personal preference on if you want or if you like the double bubble look or if you prefer the coarse a smooth look. Either way, you can't go wrong with either of these windscreens. Please go to www.zerogravityracing.com dot com place your order for these windscreens and you'll be very pleased with your Kawasaki Ninja H2 and as always thanks for viewing